welcome to my channel. My name is Karen, and the name of my channel is PR Girl for Puerto Rican Girl. I hope that everyone is doing well and safe. In today's video, I will be sharing with you my picks from the Pandora Buy to Get One Free promo that they had, I think, about two weeks ago. I purchased my items online. I also went to the store and did another promo. I purchased the very last day. I was so busy these past few weeks. So yes, I couldn't purchase before, but I'm very excited that I did. I was sort of debating whether I was gonna go in with this promo because I'm waiting for the Disney 100 and I know those items, the charms that they will be releasing are expensive. So I wasn't sure, but at the end of the day, you know, I went for it. I have so many pieces on my wish list. So yes, I did. I also got one of these um, thinners, Jewelry Care Kit. I love this and I needed a backup. So that's what you see this in here. So I will share with you first the items that I purchased in store. I will also try to show you how I want to use my items, the charms that I got, where I want to put them. And yeah, so that's the plan for today. So I have in here, let me show you, two boxes I Deep went to the store, as I said, because I wanted to buy a present for a friend. And so I took advantage of the promo. So you only see two boxes because I already gifted my friend her present. So let's start with one of these. Let's see. Oh, and here you see this beautiful earring. They're so pretty. These ones are the ones that Pandora, I think they released this last fall. Um, they had the rings for some time for their birthday. This one is the one for October. Uh, my birthday month is July, but I love pink, so I wanted this one. At the same time, my um, little one, um, who is now four, I was born in October, so I have an October key. I love that shade of pink, very vibrant. I also love the three beads that is holding the stone. This is synthetic, of course, and I really like the details of this one. I would like to collect some of these, not all of them, but some. Let me get them out of here. Sorry about that. So, yes. Here you go. It's so pretty. I mean, just a stud, but the color, it's just everything. And I really like the way they did with the silvers with this collection. I don't own any of the charms yet, because yes, I have plans to get some eventually. But yeah, I'm just very excited to get these earrings. Okay, since I opened that one first, I know for sure what is in this one. And here I have a ring of the same collection. I was debating which one to get. I was, um, you know, unsure if I was going to get the one for October, which is related to these earrings, the pink one, or the one for my birthday month, which is July. I only own one of those, which is this one. This is the one, I believe it's, may if i'm not mistaken this is the green one and i bought this ring because i didn't have much um green on my rings and i thought it was so pretty so you see there's no um particular reason why or related to any month i don't have anybody in my family that i can recall or remember that has a birthday in may so yeah i just love this ring and so after all i decided to go with here this one and this one is the one for july let me zoom in so here it is it is the one for july it is supposed to be a light red i know january is a darker shade of red october is pinkish and this one is just red because it's trying to emulate the ruby which is the stone for july i of course eventually want to get the pink one for october but I don't know, I wanted to get this one first. I also own the birthday blooms in those uh, months, uh, January, July, and October, because those are my immediate family ones, my baby, my boy, and then my husband. So yeah, I'm, I'm happy to have this one. Let me bring the earrings so we can compare the colors. Let me see how I do this. Oh, there you go. So as you can see, this one is sort of like, like a magenta pinkish tone, and this one is more reddish. But, you know, I will still use the ring when I'm using the earrings because they will go so well. I got the ring in size 54. Let me try it for you. I am wearing this today, which I love. I have some two tones on my um, wrist. So that's why I have this one. 
And then also this beautiful ring with 14K and the flowers. Love it. So here you go. It's so pretty, so cute, very dainty. And I can always start with this one. This is sort of more of a Christmas look <laughs> with the green and the reddish tone. But yeah, they're also pretty. And then my third pick with this promo, my free item, was another of these rings, but I got it for my friend whose birthday was in February. So I got her the one with the purple stone and she was so happy with it. So that was my first promo. Now, the second one, as I say, I order online. So I have my package here. Just, just go I, right away and open it. So I'm very excited for this one. As I say, I purchased one more promo here. So let's take a look. So my items are all in this box. So let me put them away, this away. So here they are. Let me just grab one. Okay, I'm so excited. <laughs> oh, I need to bring some scissors. All right, I have my scissors. So let me open this. So I got for sure some Disney items. Um, so my first two items are Disney. Um, the free one could not be Disney, so that's okay. But I have so much Disney on my wish list. So let me show you this one. Here is the item number. So here is my first item. I decided to go for the new Disney Tinkerbell Celestial Thimble. This is super cute. Me, this one was the most interesting charm out of this collection, but I'm gonna say it. I want all the pieces. I love all the charms. I also love the ring and the bracelet. So eventually I plan to get all. I was tempted to get the five of them to have access to that super cute jewelry box that they did for Tinkerbell. But because I have decided that I would go for the Disney 100 collection, that collection is very expensive. So I resisted. And when the promo came in, I thought that I could get at least one first. This one is super cute. As you can see, you have the thimble. I love the details of the sparkles and the stars. They have some um, yellow CCs or stones, synthetic stone in here. Oh, and in fact, I have my yellow nails ready starting spring. So welcome in spring. Love that. <laughs> and so, yes, I really like this combination of the um, green from headdress and then the sparkles right there. There's a few I know. Here's another one. I really like these details in here as well. And the thimble itself is super cute. The details on it are just spot on and perfect. Tinkerbell is just adorable. I love her bone, of course. Her wings, you can see right there. Her beautiful dress in green. And then also, I really like the position of her legs. Very pretty and girly, glamorous at the same time. The bottom of it is like so. It says Pandora, Disney, and the... 925A is actually inside the timber on the top part right there. I hope you can see. Um, yes, yeah, it's super cute. Let me show you the back. So here is the back. Oh, look at the details on this charm. It's just amazing. Just, ah, I love it, love it, love it. Oh, and there's a pretty one in here, another star with the um, yellow stone. And then this one in here as well. I don't know if those are stone or sissies. And here's another one. I really like that. And look at the wings. I think you can see the wings even better from this side, from this view. It is a super cute charm and I could not resist ordering on this occasion. I feel I will also eventually get the jello one from that collection. And it would be really pretty to have a ring stack wearing my um, Tinkerbell pieces with those rings, super cute. And then here for you to see, I have brought some of the other items that I have from the Tinkerbell Disney collection. I have this star that has Tinkerbell in the inside and CCs on it, green CCs. I have her dress, of course, so pretty. I love those dresses, you know that. 
And then I have two of the Muranos from the collection. As you can see, they're very different in size, but I don't mind that. I bought them in separate occasions, so it's okay. And here is the thimble. I, you can see everything goes really well together. This one, of course, I just received, so it's very shiny, but eventually it will oxidize. It look really pretty. I, you know, as I said, I would love to get the bracelet and design a full design with my pieces, but I thought about putting them on a bangle and I thought about sharing that with you in here. So let me do that. I have this open bangle, which as you can see, currently it doesn't have any charms. So I plan to put the charms in there. And then here as well, I have my Winnie the Pooh bangle, open bangle design. I haven't changed that one at all. Um, by the way, these baggies I get from Amazon. I always link these on my information box down below. So in case you want to um, purchase them, you can go ahead and check that. I love them so much. I always have backup. But this is my Winnie the Pooh bracelet. I designed this oh, right there. I designed this one last fall and I haven't changed it a bit. I love it so much. And yes, it's just a pretty one. So let me put my charms on this um, open bangle and share the design with you. So this is how I'm gonna have them on my bracelet, on my bangle. I place Tinkerbird dress in the center, then the two Muranos, and then the star with the thimble. Um, the star is a little bit wider compared to the thimble, so that's why I place the slimmer Murano next to the star and the chubbier one next to the thimble. As I say, I know this mini design will evolve because I want to design a full bracelet. And although the Muranos are different in size, I'm pretty sure when I design my full moments bracelet, there will be a part and I'm, you know, that doesn't bother me at all. And I feel it's perfect for spring, even with my yellow nails right now. I love the contrast of those colors. I'm not much of a green person, I must admit it. But I'm going to say that lately I have been loving it. I'm currently wearing my design with Tiana. Here is Tiana. And I have these wild Muranos, wild flower Muranos in here, which are green. And I have been, you know, loving the green look, even with my green um, clips right here. If you haven't seen the video of this design, which is with two tones of the princess and the frog, I'm going to link it over here for you to see. But yeah, I'm very happy with this one. In fact, I could actually wear this one also with the stack I'm currently wearing. Hold on. There you go. This is how it looks on my crease. I'm also wearing this T-bar bracelet, which currently I have a few two-tones on it, my recent ones. And then of course my beloved 14K bangle. And so yeah, that's how it will look. What do you think of that? I really like it. And as I say, I hope that I can get that bracelet soon. Look at that, isn't that cute? I love the contrast of those greens with the surroundings that is mostly pink and white. It's just super cute. All right, so let's get another piece from the promo that I bought. Let me bring the scissors right here so I can open this. And let me get the charm. As I said, this is gonna be another Disney charm. Here is the item number. So on this occasion, I went for Disney Alice in Wonderland baby Churcher cat. He's so cute and adorable. I have said plenty of times that I would like to collect all these Disney babies. And I was searching online and I realized they came some time ago. They came in 2018. Um, you know, it has been slow for me. So far I have Mickey, Minnie, I have Scherzer now, and I got Pluto in the winter sale. And when I saw that Pluto was in the winter sale, I got kind of scary thinking that they might retire all of them or some of them soon. So I just decided for this promo that I wanted to get another one. And eventually I hope I can get them all because these are so adorable. I, of course, have all five of the princesses. And I hope that Pandora, please Pandora, bring the other princesses one day. I would like to have all the baby princesses to match my dresses, including Tinkerbell, you know. But anyhow, Churcher is super cute. I love his big, white smile. All the details from his teeth and his mustache, super cute. The nose, as you can see, it's very detailed as well. And I appreciate that Churcher has 
his eyes with black enamel compared to the princesses, which they don't have any details on their eyes. I love that they did that for Churcher. And look at the top, his ears with purple enamel and his hair, his eyebrows, everything is just perfect with him. Of course, his attire, his paws, all the details on it are amazing. I love the pink on it, very pretty. And the way he's holding his face with his arms, it's just beautiful. And here is the back, and I must say that I adore his tail and the stripes on his garment, on his clothing. And here on the side, on the left side, you see Disney, the S925L on the center, and then on the right, Pandora. He's just adorable. As I said previously, I'm going to be sharing with you my current design. So this one is the one that I have for Alice in Wonderland. I really like this one. Love the happy vibes with the tones, the colors, perfect for spring or any occasion. In here, I have a few of the previously released charms, um, like these two right here. And I have some from the um, recent collection. Um, now that I have Cherchier, when I bought him, I wasn't sure how I was going to place him on this design, which, by the way, is on the mesh bangle, as you can see. I like designing on my bangles. I know some people don't, but I like the flowy look anyhow. And so, yeah, so I wasn't sure how I was going to be placing Cherchier in here. I still need to get the beautiful teapot, but that one increasing price is $95. I remember when it came out, it was $75. I wish I purchased back then, but you know, eventually I will get it and that's going to balance for sure, sure, sure. But now I'm not sure when I'm going to put it. I still need to get a few other charms to create my bracelet, but yeah, I'm just very happy to have him now. And I thought maybe I could put it in the center. Let me try that. So here is the design with Churchill on it. So I placed him in the center of the bracelet. And looking at this, I feel it would be ideal for me to have a dangle in the center. But I would still wear it like this. He's so cute and he makes me smile. He's so cute. Um, so yeah, I'm very happy for this. And I just love it. Love it, love it. Okay, so I placed my Alice in Wonderland design in here. And I already grabbed my very last charm from this promo. This is the one that I got for free. And here is the item number. Well, here, here is the item number. So let me open this and share it with you. And I'm going to say that this one was a gift from Hobby. So he basically gave me some money for this promo. And he wanted me particularly to pick this charm that I will share with you. And this cutie was my free item, the belly last charm. And I'm going to tell you, this was my husband gift for Valentine's. He basically gave me some money for it and he said that he wanted me to purchase this one. I told him about the promo and he said, you know, um, you can buy whatever you want, but I want you to get the typewriter because back in December, he asked me if I wanted Pandora for Christmas. I gave him a list and for the charms, I, you know, shared the special moments and the sentiments attached to them. And I think he sort of mentioned to me that he left this one for Valentine's because because he loves what he has on it and the sentiment behind it. So as I said, this one is the typewriter. This one actually came in the Valentine's collection of last year. I love the pink CCs on it. Beautiful. The details are just amazing on this one. It's super cute. Um, I don't know. Let me see if I can zoom in further. So there you go. As you can see, this one has an inscription. Um, it is not that noticeable. Perhaps when it oxidizes, it will do or stand out more. It says, you are my type. And it has a heart after that. And he loved that, that, you know, the charm says that because I sent him the list and sent him pictures. And here on the... Um, Typewriter itself, it has the word love and the O is with a heart as well. Look at the side details of this. It's so pretty. And of course, this is representing the paper, of course, from the typewriter. Let me show you the back. So this is the back. Look at that. Oh my gosh, this is amazing. All the details in here, just ah, wonderful, wonderful. And here is the 
inscription S925L and on the other side is plain. Super cute charm. And I wanted this one, you know, besides of course the sentiment that it was gifted to my by my husband in Valentine's, but I have strong memories of typewriters. I remember that I learned hard to type on one of those. I know, um, you know, it's, it's not like I learned. I started, you know, typing one my, that my mind had at home. And then when we got our first computer, I learned how to type correctly. So I type very fast and I play games and all that. So I have very fun memories. Of at the same time, Pandora doesn't have a computer charm or even a cell phone charm. I know they have a vintage one. But I would love to see some tech charms from Pandora. I use a computer all the time, a laptop and a computer on my office. So I would love to see that on Pandora Strange. But anyhow, I love this charm and I will show you now the bracelet this charm will go in. I think you will have guessed right that this bracelet will go on my personality bracelet. As you can see, I have so many beautiful charms in here in terms of pink some red in there on those clips and the kit had in charms i love this bracelet i'm gonna say i have been enjoying wearing it a lot the kit hair in pieces represents self-love positiveness and you know i just love this bracelet so much and i thought of course of putting the new typewriter charm new to me in here it would be wonderful on it and at the same time i'm also loving stacking this bracelet let me show you with this radiant hearts bangle isn't that super pretty together and i know for sure the ring and the earrings will be matching this also pretty well well you guys that's it for this video i hope you enjoy watching my picks from the recent pandora buy to get one free promo as well as some updates of my design using my new acquisitions if you enjoy watching this video please remember to give me a thumbs up and consider subscribing to my channel i will really appreciate having you here thank you very much for watching i will see you in the next one bye bye gracias